PR Pro Cannabis Media. Ho, 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 and happy holidays, everybody. From Boston, Massachusetts, in the studios of Pro Cannabis Media, I'm Jimmy Young, and I am so happy to be joined 3,000 miles away in Seattle, Washington, with the Sativa Santa himself. Hello, Santa. How are you doing during this holiday? Oh, 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 how are you doing today, Jimmy? Are you being good? No, I'm never good. No, <laughs> I, don't, I, don't I love that. At least you're, at least you're forthright. Oh, ho. Oh, oh. So, so Sativa Santa, first of all, how did you get this nickname of Sativa, which is a cannabis strain, Santa? Well, you know, okay. So I am one with the plant, Jimmy. The plant and I are very close friends. And then, you know, I do get around some. I wear many hats, wink, nod. And so, you know, during the season a little bit there, I wear some red. But most of the time, I'm wearing the green. Oh, oh. Do I, do I sense an Irish accent in there somewhere, Santa? Well, you know, I'm actually, that's North Polish <laughs> because I come from the North Pole. There you go. Let me ask you a question. When you deliver your goods on Christmas Day to all those adults over 21, right? We're making sure that these gifts of cannabis are going to adults, correct? Yep, yep, yep. Well, you know, it's essential for you and for me. Winky <laughs> wink. Winky oh, wink. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> What's the what is the most popular gift for Sativa Santa during this time of year? Yeah, you know, it's funny. It kind of goes between the Christmas candy edible, ho ho, as well as the the wonderful pre-rolled holly, everybody loves some pre-rolled holly, and my own personal favorite, a top shelf quarter, because that will pretty much make for a wonderful day. <laughs> and that's what we like here, you know, to put a little good buzz on every day, just to make yourself feel a little bit better and improve the day. Now, I noticed uh, you, you say you're from Seattle. Can we get a look at exactly where you are on the streets of Seattle? Can we get a little peek? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. OK, so here you go. Here's a live real time. All right. We're in my snowy globe. All right. So and then oh, yeah. you're in yeah. Seattle. So it's pouring down rain. Hey, there's Mrs. Claus. Oh, wow. <laughs> there's people. Oh, yeah. And then, you know, here's the other thing. We're having a lot of fun, even if it is a little wet out here. Yes. Well, isn't that tradition in Seattle? You always have to deal with the rain in Seattle. Oh, yeah. You know, one of the things that we note is that rain is just very warm snow. Right. <laughs> Yes, it is. Uh, can I ask Santa a, a question? You know, 2020 was a really a long year and it was, it was miserable with this pandemic and, and businesses closing. And it was a real it was a real struggle for so many people. What what's Santa's message for moving into the next year? Sure, sure. You know, here's the thing. You know, it's not always easy being good, right? Right. But you know what? So long as you're trying, if you're trying, what happens is good comes and it happens for all of us. So I really do think this next year, I think it's going to be bang up fun. And I think the industry is going to go off. Oh, oh, oh. Well, we, we certainly hope so. If you could pick, there were a lot of big stories, and I'm, and I'm doing this top five stories of 2020 in cannabis. If you could pick one major story that happened in cannabis in 2020 or maybe two, what are two of the biggest things as far as cannabis news goes for, for Sativa Santa? Yeah, you know, here you go. I think the way that the industry has really come along and shown itself during the pandemic and I think that, you know, let's face it, for a lot of us, you know, cannabis is, it's a medicine, you right. know, it's a medicine. And the way that that has shown itself to be during the pandemic, to me, is one of the silver linings of the pandemic. You know, I hate the dang thing, 
But I will say, you know, lemon to lemonade, right, Jimmy? That's right, <laughs> lemonade. And, and you're in a bubble. I mean, a lot of people lived in a bubble these days because you want to socially distance. I mean, we're 3,000 miles away. There's no way you're going to catch anything from me, right? <laughs> well, you know, except maybe this whole kind of the munchy thing. But, you know, aside <laughs> from that, I think we're good. Oh, oh. <laughs> all, right. all right, Sativa Santa. So is there uh, another special um, that I might find, a little special gift that I might find under my Christmas tree if I go looking for it? Because I really did always have good thoughts anyway in 2020. Well, you fine. know, I was talking to the elf some, and we were thinking that maybe a nice, you know, an eight ball of some top shelf hash Fresh out of Afghanistan might be the perfect thing for you because Thanks. you are good. Thank you. I appreciate that. And sure enough, uh, my most recent medicine that I picked up was a little bubble hash. So there you go. Oh, and I, and I do appreciate We didn't plan that either. So I do appreciate you thinking of me, uh, Sativa Santa, on this very special day. So again, uh, wonderful to see you. Uh, rest up. I know you got a big day coming up in a couple of a couple of days here, so we want you to be in fine fit form when it comes to that uh, December twenty fifth day. You'll be ready, right? Well, you know what they say: Dutch treat. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> well, that's the Sativa Santa from Seattle. We wish everybody a happy holiday season here from Pro Cannabis Media in Boston to Seattle and all the points in between. And remember, it's a whole new world of weed out there. Use it responsibly. Thanks, Santa. You are good. You are good. We Talk Now, We Talk News, and In the Weeds are all available on most major podcast distributors like iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, and our friends at clnsmedia.com and our flagship, cannabis.net. So subscribe, share, and like our videos on all the social media networks out there, including LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, The Weed Tube, and YouTube. Weed Talk and In the Weeds are two productions of Pro Cannabis Media supported by Revolutionary Clinics, one of the top medical cannabis dispensaries in the Massachusetts area. Now with three locations in Greater Boston, two in Cambridge and one on Broadway in Somerville. Rev Clinics has a patient first mission. They will customize your needs as a medical patient with the proper titration and combination of strains, flavors, and products. Rev Clinics, where the patient comes first.